It's no secret that there are a lot of annoying influencers online, and today is no exception. I was browsing YouTube and came across Julian Newman Goes to College and decided to give it a watch. Let me just say, I regretted it. What up, Jit? About time. That's how you do family and shit? We gotta wait outside? So if you guys don't know who Julian Newman is, he was once a childhood basketball prodigy, but after growing up, he was not blessed with high genetics, so he suffered in high school and never ended up with a scholarship to play basketball in college. Julian has had a history of being annoying. Hey, tell somebody who can guard me for real. So I wouldn't say any of his behavior in this video is out of the ordinary, but after not being able to find any deals to play basketball after high school, it is pretty funny to watch him act like this. Oh, so now we gotta come at a certain time. Get the fuck out of here, bro. I'm now, I'm not one to curse around family, and I understand every family dynamic is different, but it just seems a little crazy to be including a clip like this in a vlog to me. We'll be seeing a lot of this throughout the video. Well, I wanna know what Jaden Newman does. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's your scooter? We taking that motherfucker out. You dumb. Come on, bro. Yeah, yeah, you crazy? Right. I'm I don't know why he decides to throw clips in here to make himself look like this. It pretty much sums him up as a person, so I'm not even going to bother with this one. This is fire. You can't put this on the wood, can you? Because I want to ride this on the course so bad. Yo, this is fire. You get to work out here every day. Yes, Julian, if you're a college athlete, you get your own facilities to work out in. I really don't understand why he's acting so surprised here. I thought most people probably knew this, but I guess he didn't know because he's not on a basketball team anymore. Horse? I'll bust your ass on horse. Wait, no, if you win, I have to ride around campus on a scooter in my underwear, no shirt. <laughs> You hear how hype this shit is, though? I gotta show up when I have to. <laughs> I'm actually super surprised he decided to include him losing to both his sister and his dad, since he's normally super competitive and doesn't seem to want to be seen in a negative spotlight, but I have to give him props for that, to be honest. Let's check out the punishment now, but of course, in Julian Newman fashion, we need to break some rules first. It's my school. Excuse me. It's trying to get to class. <laughs> Hold that door. I seriously don't get why he needs to act like he's better than everyone. Bro proceeds to say, this my school, and hasn't even gone to college. I think it would have been funny to see him get kicked out, but I feel like Julian is the type of guy to pull a Jack to Hardy and just argue with security saying he wasn't doing anything wrong and then refuse to leave instead of just dipping because, you know, it's content, right? Okay, so I respect Julian for keeping his word for his punishment, but come on, man, this does not qualify as around campus. Your boy is just riding back and forth in a parking lot with not a single soul in sight. I ain't gonna lie to you, if I went here, this is just off topic for real, but I'll be getting my d*** stuck right there. People will really say anything for the camera, huh? Like, this is his sister. Also, people are walking by, but I doubt they're listening. But if they do hear, I wonder what they're thinking. <laughs> Yo, bro. Yo, bro, there's not one person that's like, damn, that nigga nice fit. Yeah, yeah, it's like, damn, Y'all niggas really out here on the West Coast can't dress. Why does he think he dresses any better? Like he's wearing a white t-shirt and he's calling that style? Julian surprises me at how much of a perpetual asshole he is. There is no reason to even say anything like this. Just mind your own business, man. It's not that hard. Oh, and I need to mention right after this clip, Julian is hanging on to his past so hard at his high school peak that he makes sure the viewer on this video sees that he is so-called famous by including every single time anyone wanted to take a picture with him. Bro had to milk it out, but honestly, I won't even bash him for this since it does seem like it would be pretty cool to be recognized a lot. 
I just mainly think it's funny because he included every single instance of this happening on the campus. Oh, of course, of course. Are you good, bro? You good? How you doing? Oh man, nice to meet you, bro. Did you go take a picture? All right, I appreciate it. How you doing, bro? How you doing, man? Anyways, let's just sum up this video with the last few cringy things he says. Dude, now she's on her way to fucking class. We test, we're asking, you know, hey, ass. Would you think that I do that by the way that I look, sir? Yeah. I made that hold up. I'm dropping, dropping her off the class just so she knows how to get there, you know? Because I graduated from here four years ago. Julian is too good for college, guys. Screw college. He doesn't need it. Although he actually spits facts in this final clip, though. They don't pay you to go to college. You pay to go to college. Whether you paying for it or not, money is coming from somewhere to be paid for. The tuition ain't free. All right, this video gets a 10 out of 10 from me now. Julian's economic and financial knowledge is unmatched. 